On October 29, 2003, an aluminum dust explosion occurred at a facility in Huntington, Indiana, during chip processing. The incident killed one worker, critically injured another, and left four others with minor injuries. The explosion destroyed the dust collection system, damaged nearby equipment, and blew off part of the roof. A fire followed, causing additional damage to the facility and its operations. The event underscored the severe hazards of combustible dust and inadequate safety systems. What happened? On October 29, 2003, 2.30 p.m., maintenance personnel noticed a smoldering fire in a fume duct connected to Furnace 5. Following standard practice, they shut down the chip feed and allowed the fire to extinguish on its own. At 8.20 p.m., the chip feed system was restarted. For the next 10 minutes, chips fed steadily into the furnace. However, a mechanic observed chips falling from a spark box in the dust duct, a sign of system blockage. At 8.30 p.m., as workers attempted to address the issue, a fireball erupted from Furnace 5's vortex box. The explosion traveled through the dust collector and ducts, causing the dust collector to rupture and blow fragments against nearby structures. The blast propagated through the facility, lofting and igniting accumulated aluminum dust, resulting in a secondary deflagration that blew open the roof. A fire ensued, igniting nearby plastic pallets and combustible materials, including roofing insulation. The flames were eventually contained by the local fire department using specialized Class D extinguishers. What are the root causes? Lack of hazard awareness. The facility did not identify or mitigate the explosion risks associated with aluminum dust. Inadequate dust collection system. The system lacked proper explosion venting and isolation mechanisms. Poor housekeeping. Dust accumulation on horizontal surfaces and within equipment created significant fuel for the secondary explosion. Design and maintenance gaps. The system's design allowed dust buildup, and maintenance practices failed to address the hazards of existing fires. Inadequate training. Employees lacked training on the hazards of aluminum dust and emergency response protocols. Key lessons and mitigations. Upgrade dust collection systems. Install explosion venting, isolation barriers, and systems to prevent dust accumulation. Enhance maintenance and housekeeping. Regularly inspect and clean dust-prone areas to minimize combustible dust risks. Provide worker training. Educate employees on aluminum dust hazards and emergency response procedures. Adopt industry standards. Follow NFPA guidelines for handling and managing combustible metal dusts. Thank you for watching.